fact, let's focus in on the auto space and soon you'll be able to see affordable electric cars on the road. The likes of Tata Motors and MG Motors are planning mass market electric vehicles. These cost efficient hatchbacks are likely to be launched by early 2024 in the sub 8 lakh rupee segment. Let's bring on board Utkash Chaturvedi who joins in with more details. Utkash? Well, if you look at uh, EVs right now, what you see, you see EVs which are expensive in pricing. You see EVs which are big because they are either sedan at this point of time or SUVs. But this is what Tata Motors is now looking to change. They are eyeing at that 72% market in the PV space, which is hatchbacks. And they are looking to come up with cost-efficient range of hatchbacks. The first one, what they will be coming up within the next two years, what our sources tell us, the target to the internal teams is 8 lakhs. And this 8 lakhs is not to make an 8 lakh car anyhow. The target is to be achieved keeping the performance, keeping all the features which are currently available in the Nexon, in the Tigor, to come in 8 lakhs. Obviously the R&D team is working, but that is what Tata Motors is aiming at. What is MG Motors aiming at? MG Motors is also looking to get into this market, our sources tell us. They are looking at a 7 to 8 lakh vehicles as well, but they are looking to get the funding, that, uh, get them start the project, but that's their aim. Uh, and the interesting part is that uh, you will see a lot of action in the mass market without the mass market leaders. Remember, Marty had started with Dragon R EV, closed the project because they were not able to make it sub 10 lakh as a product. Will Marcy also look to enter this game once they enter this game in 24-25? It will, will be something which will be very interesting to watch. But till then, it will be Tata Motors who currently has 70% of the market share looking to get into cost-efficient EV hatchbacks to capture the volume of the market. Utkar, thanks very much for filling us in with those details. With the pre-open race indicating a fairly decent start, let's find out some mid-cap strategies then. And Nuresh, what's catching your eye this morning? So that would be a buy-on.